Click, click, boom. Your event is in the calendar. I'm showing you the add to calendar button in this video. You'll see what it can do and how to use it. This button is free to use 100%. It's actually open source. It's actually a JavaScript script, but it's simple to put in your website. But wait, it works for smartphone. For iPhone users in Safari, touch, touch, boom. You now have the event in your phone's calendar. Android user, touch, touch, boom. Again, the event is in the phone's calendar. Okay, let's see how to add this to any web page. I created a very basic HTML file. I'll add it in three easy steps. Step one, I'll import the script and the file to the web page. Step two, I create a tag element and add the class ATCB to it. And step three, I'll just copy and paste the example JSON from the documentation. The JSON dictates the button's configuration. Create as many as you want on one page. Each button has its own details like name, date, description, start time, end time, stuff like that. Everything is configurable through the JSON. But wait, what if I'm using Angular or React? What do I do then? There's an npm package that you can install to use this button in React, Vue or Angular. And there's documentation of how to add it. Cool, right? If you want code examples on how to add this button to all the specific scenarios like HTML, Angular, React or Vue, if 10 people ask me in the comments to make such a video, I will. Pinky swear. Okay, another cool part about this small little open source free script is that it's very, very well documented. For a script that's this small and easy to have a very well written documentation, it's something to be appreciated. You have examples and written details of what you can do with the JSON and how you can configure it. Like I said before, from title to description to start date, end date, time zone, time, everything is configurable using the JSON. And you can basically just create as many buttons as you want with different details. You can even style the button itself using CSS. All right, I just wanted to show you this amazing little free button. And if you remember in a previous video, I sat down with the creator of this button, Jens, and he told me about the motivation when he was building it and what inspired him to create this little script. Subscribe for more videos like this. I'm Chip and as always, I'll see you next time.